unforgiveness is hypocrisy. To ask God to forgive me when I won't forgive others is to burn the very bridge I myself must cross. To ask God to forgive me when I will not forgive others is literally to burn the steps I have to get to Christ myself. Unforgiveness for the Christian is a sin. It's not to make light of what we went through, but Christ says, if I've paid it all, you can pay it forward. If I've forgiven you of all your sins, you now can forgive others, for I am fighting on your behalf. He gets back to this king. This king is angry. He, he comes, he says, the servant to come here. He says, I offer you mercy. Why did you offer the same? Then he throws him in jail. Now the disciples are hearing the story. They're going, good job, king. That's what they get. They lied on me. They talked about me behind my back. Good job. You are good, honest king. Good job. But in verse 35, Christ throws an unexpected blow. He says, and so my father will do to you if you don't forgive from your heart. Man, I love my Savior. He's crafty with his words. He's, he's brilliant. What he does is he takes this story now and turns it back on the listener as if to say, are you the unforgiving servant? When you look back over your life and the friendships that you don't, that you no longer have, are those gone because you were unwilling to forgive? Christ is saying, I'm offering you freedom. Some of you right now, you, you've allowed one person in one moment of time with one sin to have a life-altering effect on you. You've changed your personality all because of what someone did. Hear me, that is too much power. Some of you right now are in prison just with no bars. You're in bondage to unforgiveness and Christ is saying, let it, give it to me and I will take, I will take charge of it. Forgiveness offers you peace of mind. It offers you restored relationship. And most importantly, hear me, forgiveness keeps your walk with Christ consistent and intimate. In verse 35, Christ is not saying you forgive in order to get into heaven. But proof that heaven has gotten into you is that you forgive and forgive and forgive. 